you kind of have to ask yourself too, like, who is the villain here? Yeah, you're absolutely right, because I think that's what what you ask yourself with revenge thrillers or horrors. You do ask that question, and I think with this, it's not as easy to define. Okay, in classic gay cinema, we as queer viewers are going to automatically side with Jules. Homophobic attack. We anchor the whole story around Jules and Jules' retribution, but you could turn the whole film around, and you could anchor the whole thing around Preston, as someone who is in the closet, does not have the right language or mechanisms to describe their feelings or emotions, lashes out at somebody, but really wants to explore their sexuality. So I get it. Yeah, you're right. There's a there's a binary, simplistic way to say Jules is Jules is the victim, and they are, but actually they're both victims of a situation. I think that's interesting to play with. 